welcome back guys i am back for another video and i apologize for not uploading last week i just didn't feel like it was right to upload last week something was not feeling right last week so i didn't upload but yeah i'm back now and no more breaks and um i'm gonna be talking about five signs that you may be an old soul so yeah guys without further ado let's just get straight to the video I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I did not mention that in the intro, but I hope you guys are having a blessed day on this wonderful Monday. And also, the first sign that you may be an also is that you're a solitary loner. And by what I mean by that is that you prefer solitude. Solitude is like, so how can I say, you know how people love pizza? People love pizza. Solitude is like pizza to you. The best way I can describe it. You prefer to be alone. Alone, when you're alone, you feel better. You don't you don't feel like you don't feel bad. Some people when they're alone, they just can't be alone. But when you're an old soul, being alone is not a problem for us. So yeah guys. You're a solitary loner. First sign. The second sign is you understand that knowledge is power. You understand that wisdom is happiness and you understand that the truth is freedom. But what I mean by this is that my knowledge is, Ty Lopez even said it, the more you learn, the more you earn. Knowledge is, you understand that money is not power. You understand that money is not power. You understand that knowledge is power. Knowledge is what, the more like you understand about things, the more smarter you get. But how else can I say this? Is that knowledge is, you, you prefer to keep learning more and more. You're more attuned to learning more you're more curious about everything so you want to learn more about everything that you can learn about and um wisdom is like you understand that wisdom is happiness we all have that inner wisdom in us yeah wisdom is happiness because people set their happiness on money and you realize that money is not happiness and also you understand that the truth sets you free because the truth is always going to set you free you understand that when you lie you're not free. You understand that when you say when you tell lies, you're deceiving people. The goal is not to deceive anyone. The truth is what sets you free. The third sign is that you see the bigger picture to everything. No matter what that circumstance may be, you just find a way to see the bigger picture to it. If something bad happens to you, you find a bigger picture to it. No matter how hard that circumstance may look to you, you always find something better to make that that circumstance a better a better thing for you because that's that's what old souls tend to do we don't we don't we don't hold a grudge on certain things we find the bigger picture to everything so yeah the third sign that you may be an old soul is that you see the bigger picture to everything the fourth sign is you aren't materialistic the flashy iPhones the flashy you know, like uh, watches, you know, Rolexes, the Louis belt, the Louis Vuitton belt, the Supreme, all those high, high, like high designer stuff, that doesn't matter to you. You understand that that really does not matter because you understand that those things does not come with you in the next, in, like that stays on earth. You understand that you can't take none of that with you. So you understand that materialistic things doesn't really matter to you. I understand. That I'm being really repetitive right now, so I just caught that. But yeah, guys, but you just gotta you just gotta see the bigger picture of everything. Even though I'm being repetitive, it's funny to me. But yeah, um, you just aren't materialistic. You see these people with these new iPhones, and you're just like, that doesn't matter. And then you see people with these designer. And you see everybody with designer belts. Half the time they're fake. Don't want to spoil it for anybody, but yeah, they're fake. But it doesn't matter, you know, whatever people want to wear, they can go ahead and wear. But, you know, for us, we understand that that, that does not matter to us. That's, that's useless. This is nonsense, actually. But yeah, that's the fourth sign. The fifth sign is you feel old, but you just can't describe it. You just don't know how, like, you just don't know how, why you feel old, but you just, you know that you're, you feel old. See, I'm 17, but like... <laughs> I'm not really 17 oh, no. eons, eons old. Like, I can't even explain it to you guys. You probably would think I'm crazy. I'm not crazy. I'm just telling the truth. Yeah. But anyways, you feel old. And the better way I can describe it is that old souls, you understand that you've been on this earth more than once. 
you, you have that feeling that you've been here before. You just it seems familiar to you. Do you ever have deja vu? That's a sign that you may be in also as well. If you have deja vu, that means you experienced that before. Hey okay, guys, those are the five signs. I, I, I think I should get a little bit more detail with feeling old, but I think I described it good. You feel old. You you just have that strong urge. You feel old. You just can't describe it. But and um, yeah, those are the fifth signs. I'm gonna add a sixth sign. For a bonus sign i'm not gonna put in the title though the sixth sign is that when you were young you just you couldn't fit in with the other kids because you were different you were 10 you just were alone most of the time and other kids probably picked on you because of that because what they liked didn't interest you what they liked it did not interest you you were more different you 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 prefer you prefer to learn more than to play the best way i can say it so yeah, when you're a kid, you probably got picked on because you were different. You you were outside the norm. You didn't. You weren't normal. You were different. And norm and being different is awesome, guys. Embrace being different. I'm different, and I'm happy with being different. So yeah, guys, that's the sixth sign. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys understand. I hope you you learn something. And if you're an old soul, what's up, man? I'm an old soul too. <laughs> but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to spread this video with your friends, your family, your sister. Your family goes for everybody, right? So, yeah, your family. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember, guys, stay blessed. God bless. Peace, love, and tranquility. See you guys. See you guys next week.